all of you can come here. Um, I think you can make start now. So good morning. Um, so do you do you bring your trays for us? Yeah. Yeah. What happened? Let's have a look. Let's have a quick look. Oh, is it all gone? You need the media. How are we going to do? Oh, the media. Thing? The media is. Uh, Kena kencing dengan kucing So the sun just turned into a pocket later now yeah. Uh, Oh yeah, we need to get a new photographer Do you want to? Um, <laughs> oh, it's alright, it's alright you can, you can continue Alright Okay, good thing. Come on, come on. Hmm? Okay, yeah, this is what I suspected. I, I mentioned this one. Um, this, this thing is susceptible to uh, fungus. Um, you can use this ring to help stabilize your hair while doing it. Um, the thing with the main species that you use, it's kind of too fleshy because mm -hmm. it's meant to be as salad. There are several species of main, several varieties of main. The main that you use is meant for salad, so salad is very fleshy, very juicy, very happy place for microbes to thrive on. Okay, If you use different kind of um, main, like peppermint, that's rather dry, okay? And we've got uh, uh, some successful attempts using that kind of mint, okay? But that's all right, because uh, I needed uh, last week as well for the lab assistant to learn. Okay, so what I need to do, do you want to yeah, um, play around with the angle, make it look optimal, okay? If the student getting in your way, push them away. <laughs> Right. Okay, so uh, we're going to um, do it practically today because um, I've got um, places to, be, to, to go to. Two things today. So number one, I'm going to explain what's going on now um, to repeat this. And the second one, we are going to go outside and above to learn two things. Number one is how to choose the cuttings that will give you a good success rate in uh, stem propagation. Okay. And then we also will talk about the second agenda is to find natural sources of oxygen that you can get from your surrounding. Do you bring any bottle? Yes. yes. Alright, okay. What kind of bottle do you have? Uh, yeah. Five mm, Yeah, that was fine. That was fine. Okay. So, this cutting here. Um, has been um, soaked for like overnight since um, since yesterday. Yeah, I think around three or around four um, in the afternoon. So the concept is the same. Why why we um, we uh, soak this for for longer time? In your in your previous experiment, how long did you soak your cutting? One hour. Why, why, why the time is longer now? Why I make it longer? Because this is herbaceous. Okay, that's very soft. Supposedly more responsive to whatever um, hormone treatment that you are giving to the plant. These, however, these are what we call as uh, the shrub species. They are somewhat woody, of course, depending on the, the branch. So. We want it to be certain, so we just um, soak it um, overnight. Alright? Okay. Cut it um, into various length. You're going to see uh, how to choose the branching. Okay. For pine, outside, and go to find the branching. What, what one is this? Uh, okay. So let's say that this is the plant that you have chosen, and this is the main trunk. So there will be a lot of branches <coughs> coming up from the main part because this is a shrub. <coughs> when you take this, you need to um, understand there are three regions of this branch. Okay? The region, let's, let's put it in three. The region 
leader which is closest to the main plan, this is usually the, the most woody. Okay? Somewhat um, intermediate. So I guess this is a tissue, um, soft scale tissue. Okay. Based on experience, the one that is going to work very well is from this region. Okay? So this is a um, semi-part wood, something you want to call it. Okay, this is part wood. If you are referring this to a bigger tree, okay, part wood, semi-part wood, and this is the soft wood. It is not woody yet, like in this case here. Still not woody, right? It's undergoing sensitive thickening, and then um, the wood. A uh, substance will start to form. Okay? Right. So, I'm not saying that uh, the other regions are not going to produce any rooting. When you cut this, let's say this is your cutting. This is your cutting, right? When you cut this, if it is too hard, if it's too hard, there is a chance your cutting here is still not exposing the underneath layer. So when that is happening, it's very hard for the roots to come up. Okay? And also this region may be low in meritometric activity. Remember from your lesson, what is what properties of oxid? How does it travel? Just learn it. How? How does it travel? What is it about? What, what kind of oxygen transport it is? You just learn it. You just learn it. What? What? What is it? I'm asking about the number of oxygen transport. How does it move? In the cell? Does it move just to any direction, back and forth? What? Hey, don't forget this thing. Oxy? Transport. Meaning that, this is when, remember, this is when we learn the word acro factory. And the root tip, when the oxygen is here, then it goes sideways or back downward. This is this is important um, scientific terminology that you need to, to learn now. You're going to use this a lot, okay, later um, in, 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 in your uh, study years. Okay, so since oxygen has to follow from what we need that, it is produced here because we know that's a very study so it's going to go downward. This is a cutting, okay, a cutting. If you don't properly remove um, all this um, cadmium, loyal layer properly, based on experience, the routine will find hard time to come up. Okay? <clears throat> but when the cutting, the cutting is, is, is like a, a proper cut, oxygen is coming this way. What will happen eventually at this region? You will have an accumulation of oxygen. Okay? When you have accumulation of oxygen, this will trigger the, the routine formation. Okay? That is one reason. Right? Okay. But for, for that to happen, the stem makes form something like this. You need to swell for a bit. Okay. Alright. Will form rooting, but you need higher amount of toxic. Okay? In um, agricultural um, shop, if you buy oxy, there is different strength 
one, two, three, four, five. Usually you need higher strength for this to make it uh, working. But for this one, uh, it's quite fun. Yeah. Alright, okay. So do you, you have this? Um, where can you get your sand if your sand has already been turned into cat litter? What about the group? What about the group? What is your trick? What is your trick? Can you wet on this place? Wet, wet for a bit. <coughs> Our lab assistant is not around. Um, do you think you can find your the the sand on your own later? What what about the group? This is the case. Um, we can do this later because I want to um, like get up and, and do this. <coughs> um, divide this into four. Into four later. Into four. Oh, what's, what's, what's the best way to do this kind of thing? Uh, this is a bit um, not optimal. We, I would rather to have four separate pieces. Yeah, we do, we do, we do need uh, another uh, tree. Do you think you can find sand around? <coughs> or we should find, should we find, go out and find sand around? Okay, let's, let's, let's move about. Let's move about. Oh. Oh. One big leaking back. <laughs> so let's move about. Just uh, Pause, pause, you can pause. Uh, one long video. Okay. <laughs> 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 
Alright, suppose that this is the, the, um, the branch that you want to pick. So let's take one. to root or not? It might work. Actually, it depends on the species. Some species, um, uh, the, the soft wood, which is going to be very responsive. So maybe this is something for, for you to, to find out. What about this one? This is the bottom part. Is it going to root? Okay. There is a small trick that's good on this. Yeah. How to make your fruity a bit more successful? Number one, you see here, root will come out from the nodes. Okay, so you need to determine where are the nodes on your piece of stem. So your nose actually start here. You don't need all this leaf, okay? You can remove all of this leaf. You don't need oh, I kind of injured the plant for a bit, but it's alright. This is a not not a good um sketches. Okay. Right. So that is the note. You can feel it, it's a bit bumpy. It okay. is. So what you need to do is just cut in a slanting mode, just underneath of it. My, can I borrow your. Um, yes. I got it wrong. This is Thomas. Alright? Alright? <coughs> okay. So, what happened to the top part? This top part, there is um, a trick to, to, to make it um, rooting even faster. But I don't have it today. If you have a candle, you know, light up your candle, your candle is going to form the pool, the soup, right? Yeah, you dip it in there, use the molten candle to plug this area. This will prevent any bacteria from getting in and also to stop the excessive moisture from leaving your stem. So that will make your um, um, your routine to, to become faster, right? So when you have this, um, usually we will have the minimum of around three notes for each of this um, step. Is it three? This is already one. One, two, three. Yeah. It's good, it's good. It's good, it's good. Right. Let's keep this. Uh, you can take this later. You want to take this? We already got it. Uh, okay, any questions? Any questions? Any questions? Uh, what question? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> 
glass tea. <laughs> Under the knot. Under. Yeah. Under yeah. the knot. This is your meristematic area, the bumpy. The bumpy this, the bumpy part here. Oh. This is your meristematic area. If you remove this, this is the, the next best place. Alright? So remove Now the second part. Um, you see, um, in the past, you cannot go to shop and buy oxy, like the one that you you use um, um, in the lab. This is um, highly um, synthesized artificial oxy. However, if you do like a regular gardening or you are away from all these um, agricultural um, sources, you can use certain plants to get oxygen naturally because oxygen is present in all plants and every, every, everybody around here got oxygen but some species actually you got oxygen in your, tube, in your gut yeah. 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 The, the, the microbiota the doing of your microbiota right. however some some species has a bit more ability to concentrate more oxygen Okay. What, what plan is that? <laughs> what do you think? Very high in oxygen. I know every plant got oxygen in it, but this particular plant got a, like a high concentration of oxygen. It's got IBA, IAA, and also some other hormones. What? Anybody get? Mango seed. I'll give you a hint. This particular tree is very famous throughout the time, historically. It is present in the Shakespeare play, in the Hamlet. Uh, it is present in Harry Potter. It's, it's, it's a very... Fine tree. There is one tree in Harry Potter. One tree? That, that, that. Kind of magic tree. Oh, magic tree. Can you find that tree around here? We can't. I don't think so. Can you guess? What tree is that? Lion Bulabu. It's a queen gate. Queen gate. Yes, I'm aware. What tree is this? You, you see, when you are out about in, the, in, in this nature uh, setting, then you know, you know very less species of the plants and trees, which shouldn't be happening, because I know what's around your age, I already know about 1,000, 2,000. Babylonica, meaning that it has Babylonia. been around since the Babylonian time. Oh, Babylonian. Babylonian time. Yeah. Babylon. And also the Salix. That's a key word there. The name Salix actually referring to one um, hormone that you learn on Monday. Hmm. What hormone is that? Hmm. What? What hormone? Hmm. The name of this thing is Salix with Babylonica. Babylonica, you know to the bad one in time. What about the salicylic acid? Yes, salicylic acid. Oh. Yeah. You already learned it. Okay. Salicylic acid. Okay. I know the name Malay. It, it's, the English name is Weeping Willow. So the Malay name would be Jandang Marana. Jandang Marana. 
Jadi melangis. In 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 Germany they call it weeping widow. English call it weeping willow. Willow window still set. Black widow. Like any other trees, these willow tree also have a different structure chronologically. The one that you want to utilize to get your oxen is not brown or black in color. Look at the chart, but rather green or yellow in color. Yeah, if you have this kind of color, rather greenish, yellowish like this one. This is the one that you have high concentration of oxide. Okay, so if you use willow, weeping willow, as your um, rooting hormone, natural rooting hormone, you can turn it into a product that we call as willow water. That's what we we're going to do today. Willow water. Okay. In your willow water, willow water, we're going to brew this. You're going to get two hormones. Okay. Number one is the salicylic acid. Salicylic acid is actually a chemical uh, which is very popular in um, cosmetic, pharmaceutical. Yes. Okay. If you buy any um, cosmetic products, you can easily find this um, salicylic acid because it has keratolytic properties. Yes. Meaning that. If you've got acne, if you've got some trouble with your skin, if you apply salicylic acid, it's going to slough off all these um, dead cells and tissue, leaving behind smooth surface structure of your skin. Okay, all right. But what does it do? In fact, does that look need to look so beautiful, acne free? <laughs> what does it do, plan? You have. Um, you have a brew of this and your brew contains salicylic acid, what does it do? It's not really helping the rooting directly per se, but salicylic acid has another properties which is antimicrobial properties, antifungal, antibacterial, meaning that when you dip your cutting in the water, this willow water, willow solution will give antibacterial protection of your cutting. Why your cutting fail? Your mint? Fungus, right? Yes. Fungus, right? Well, welcome to tropical. That cannot be avoided. Right? So to prevent that, we can use a natural source that contains antibacterial properties. Alright? There are many other properties of uh, salicylic acid. Another one is analgesic. Analgesic is um, if you eat it, it will give a pain relief properties. Have you heard of aspirin? Yeah. Chelsea yeah. is the main ingredient. Aspirin. Yeah. You get aspirin for your headache, for your inflammation in your body. That's, that's how it works. Okay, how to get this? Um, actually, this, even though most people would take the, um, the tip of the branch, <coughs> the yellow, the green part of it, Based on, on, on literature, some trees, they, they like it more if you get the bark. Look at the bark. I do not know whether this is proven or not, but I have read a paper. If they were to do cutting for olive tree, the olive tree is more responsive if the willow water comes from the bark. Meaning that this thing got something in it as well. Definitely salicylic acid. Okay, if you can read it on the Wikipedia. It, from, from the bark of the willow, you can get salicylic acid. Right? But um, I think you need a solvent or you need to uh, like boil it to, to get it out because this is, this is very hard. Okay? So for your activity, why not you get this? Um, anybody got a bottle? Yes, yes, me. Okay. You want? Uh, <laughs> big boy. That's a very big bottle. Yes, yes, yeah. I'm function today. <laughs> big, big, so big. Big, big. Okay. Hold it, hold it, hold it. To so take this. Um, you know what? Let, let's, um, each of you, take, take one. We will continue in the lab. Take, take some, some of this. Take, 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 take,
That's why I asked you to bring the plastic bag. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's my plastic bag? Where's my plastic bag? Yeah, me one. I'm big, you're a banana. You can one. Yeah, take, take some. You can work in your group. The reason I asked you to bring your own bottle so that you can have a look in um, using your uh, own observation. Or if you feel a bit fancy, maybe you can take the stem of this thing. You can make this rooting as well. Yeah, rooting, lucky. Oksin, you should not oksin? You should not oksin? Mana oksin? Untuk pengakaran Apa? Untuk hormon Hormon? Hormon akar Bukan pengakar je Tapi pokok tu dah pucuk tak ada oksin macam mana? Habis masuk oksin kau belajar apa? Oksin 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 Use your plastic bag Okay. Like this, like this. Okay. You must. You can take some some cutting from this stem as well. Like this. Like like this. Come on. Pokok ni jadi merana. Pokok gang jadi jujur merana. Jujur kekal. Jadi merana. Okay, okay. Okay, bro. This is living. This is living. And then we still got some lime at the end of it. So cut this. Again. Ah, good thing. Okay. Thank you, Zafa. This is a cover bar. So you might want to take a picture. Okay. This is the flower 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 buds of the weeping willow. Yes, okay. Are you done? Yes. You done? You done? Thank you. Okay. Um, I'll make sure that you like not necessarily high picture, but don't cut down straight. Go around this side, that side. Okay. Uh, so that's very fast. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alright, okay, okay. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Uh, anybody want to donate me a bottle? Uh, me, me. Tapo please, don't turn that tapo away. Um, Okay. <laughs> From this, how many organs can you see? <coughs> yes, sir. How many organs can you see from this? Um, what kind of organs do we have here? Leaf. Um, which, which one is leaf? Take. Show me. Which one is leaf? Okay. Ah, uh, take. Bring your leaf. Ah, uh, what else? Stem. Stem. What else? Hmm. Fruit. Okay. Fruit. 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 Ah, this is reproductive organ. Yeah. Remember, okay? You have organs. Plants have organs. Okay. What What organs of yours equivalent to the stem? Huh? What organs of yours that is equivalent to the stem? Uh, backbone. Uh, yeah, both. Yeah, both. Yeah, both. It gives the structure different work. Alright, correct. In fact, in fact, the cell wall, which your your stem got a lot of it, the cell wall is the main component of cell wall. Is guess what? Calcium. Just like your bone. Bone. Yeah. It's called uh, calcium patinate. 
calcium. Okay, that's why you need to fertilize the soil with calcium. It's okay. Because plants need calcium to build cell wall. What do you have in your bone? Calcium. 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 Do, do plants have vitamin D? Yes. Do plants have vitamin D? Uh, yes. 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 Okay. True. Plants have vitamin D, but in different form. In us human animals, it's vitamin D three. In plants, in mushroom, vitamin D two. Yeah. But they are still uh, polycalciferol. Okay. Right. Okay, so which part do we need to do uh, to use for your oxygen experiment? Which part do you think? Not brown. Which organ? Which organ? I, I have not told you that, but my instruction is the answer to this question. What part of the organs now that you're going to use to extract your oxygen? Yeah? Stem. Why? I was very specific about the stem. What just now? What was the instruction for you to get what kind of stem from here? I told you. Number one. Huh? When I gave instruction to take the stem from this weeping window, I was being very specific to get certain kind of stem. What was it? So what do you have? Oh my God! Your 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 working memory capacity. <coughs> what? I was very very specific with the with the stem one just now. <laughs> Take two colors. Yellow. 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 Ah. Yeah. Specific. Did I being specific about the leaf? No. Mm -hmm. I was being very specific about the color. What color? Yellow, Yellow and green. Reddish. Yellow? Green. 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 Or reddish. Somewhere like <laughs> that. Okay. But not not what color? <coughs> Brown. Brown? Or black? Or woody color. Okay? Because that is the concentration uh, is the most. Okay, so for, for your um, willow water brew, you only need the stem. So what you need to do is, you need to remove all the leaves. Mm -hmm. Remove all the leaves? Actually, you don't have to throw away this leaf because this leaf has a, a lot of nutrients. You can turn it into compost. Mm -hmm. I can smell something already. Can you smell it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, it's not. It's okay. Sometimes I'm, I'm the only one who can smell it. What's <laughs> Okay, we got this right. What if you got some leaf in here? No, well, that's fine. But we'll just make uh, the whole thing uh, become mushier. Very small bits of the stem. Yeah. <coughs> you get it a lot. Get it a lot. Why do you need to cut it into small pieces? Easy. Easier. Easier for what? I don't feel any easier, you know? If you want to increase the surface area and you want to to help the chemicals inside to come up. Mm. So let's say that uh, you have got a lot of it, or if you are just too lazy, there is a quicker way to do it, but I don't want to teach it because that will cause exposure. How how much? Usually we'll have at least one tenth of your container. One at least. At least. 
more is fine. Not less than that. Is it about one chair? Okay. Maybe around that? More or less? Get water. Um, the, the, well, the best is always um, not oh, not really this water. Just just um, water that is not contaminated. If you have access to warm water, the way you do is two parts of regular tap water, mm -hmm. and then one part with boiling water. You put. The, the whole idea is to get the warm water. Go in. I don't want to use uh, the hot water in here because this will this this will crumble the bottom. This bottle here. Leave it overnight. Leave it overnight. Leave it. Leave it. Um, from my experience, I leave it to uh, about about two days. Yeah, about two days is fine. Move it around. Move it around. And then after you're done with this, do you get any cutting? Anybody got any plant cutting? Okay. Oh. 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 Oh
You'll be surprised, some people are not able to do this. Okay. So this takes a bit of practice to do. Okay. If you learn plant propagation, the cutting, how to make cutting. Okay. Yeah, like that. So you expose it. You ex you, you remove the cambium, scrap it off. So this kind of will help with the relief. What else do you need to do? Put it in here. I suggest you to prevent rotting before you put all of your cutting. Um, remove this stem. Just leave the water behind. Okay? The magic is the more stem that you have, the more IDA, IAA that you have, the, the quicker the rooting will happen. Okay? Salicylic acid and free microbial, so at least no, no fungus will come. So you're good to go. Yeah. Alright? Okay, that is all. all right. What about this? Okay, this I need your help. Um, can you get the tray? Tray, tray, tray. You need to... Um, do we only have one tray? Tray, tray. Dapatkan. Dapatkan. One, two. So let's put... Yeah. Leave it until... It's not the root. <laughs> I didn't know some plants is more because it's just all um you you can you you can close it. Oh, okay. This this looks like a very sad land after <laughs> some, no, some no, kind of black. Some no size living? No yes, mention that. Is it living? This one is living. Okay. Alright. Um you need to take I don't know how many you, you have here. Take different um sections of this. At least you have two for each group. Okay? Let's say that um, you know that this is the, the, the softest part of it. Yeah. Get one. Divide, divide your tray into four. Um, you already labeled, right? Zero. This is what? 25, 50, and 70. The one that I just took, this is Oh, there's a level here. Okay. How do you, how do you plunge it? You don't have to wash it, okay? You don't have to wash it. So this is zero. How do you, how do you do it? Yes, make a hole. Another trick is after you have done with all of this, uh, let's, let's get number 75. This is kind of too long, but it's alright. Find a plastic. That's it, you have all your um, cutting sticking up. Yeah, you need to, you need to make the, the cutting um, shorter somehow. Make it that way. Yeah, your cutting. Another another um, thing that you need to know does not need light. Rooting does not need light. Okay, just just make a small hole. Okay, very small one. I need to go. What color is the best? If you have the black one, it's even better. But this, this is already fine. This is already fine. Okay? Yeah. Kenapa kalau aku buat ini cantik aja? Kalau kau buat sengit sana, tu tak kena, tak kena pingsan lah. Alright. Okay. Can you do it? Can you do it? Alright. Okay. So this is all yours. So divide by yourself so that everybody can get some. Okay. Alright. Okay. Um, I need to go now because I'm going to ask you. Any question? Is it good? Any question? Okay. Alright. Okay. Cool. Let's go. 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 Let's go.